Hey, remember me? I want to show you something. You know the tilemap system, which lets you easily create grids of all types without worrying about position or logic? What if I told you you could harness that power without a tilemap? Attach a grid component to a game object and serialize a reference to it. Providing a vector3 int to the grid component's getCellCenterWorld function will return the world position of that tile according to the config of your grid component. This isn't overly exciting when we're talking about a square grid, but what about an isometric grid? You can alter the tile size and cell gap without changing any of your code. It also works for hexagon, both pointy and flat. Hexagon positional logic can become quite complex, but with this grid component, it's as simple as a nested for loop. I'll include the source code for this project below to help you get started. And that's all. See ya.